What's up, everybody? What's up, YouTube family? My name is Dylan. I am going to be doing reviews on airsoft gear on this channel. This channel is going to be directed for mainly airsoft gear, but we're also going to be reviewing some military uh, real steel gear as well. Um, it's kind of one and the same. So today, we're coming at you guys with our first review, which is going to be the Dagger Defense Red Dot Sight. Now, here we have the DD0, uh, I believe we have the, they have uh, four different models. We have the DD04N. Uh, you can kind of see there, um, they have four different models uh, right on the front there. Um, but it comes in this nice hard shell box. It's a plastic, uh, feels like box um, with a uh, snap uh, latch. So it is secure. Um, you can, uh, you know, you can use this for a lot of stuff. You know, I would use it as kind of just a accessory box. Maybe you could throw it in your bag. Uh, maybe throw uh, some tools in there. Maybe uh, some some spare parts, uh, screws, or uh, you know, I might throw like some parts for my high cap of pistol. Um, like some some o-rings for the the gas mags just random stuff you could throw this in there or you could throw the red dot side in there to transport it's really nice hard shell like I said uh, inside you're gonna get um, a guide you're gonna get a guide um, some sort of paper outlying uh, uh, talking about their different uh, red dot sites I'm guessing um, installation um, whatever. I never opened this up. This the installation's pretty um, straightforward. So I'm just gonna toss that in the trash. Um, guys, it's just a Picatinny. Um, they they say it's uh, called a, a, a mil spec 1913 rail um, compatible. I guess that's another word for Picatinny. Uh, so yeah, you got a Picatinny. It'll work on there. So let me go ahead and show you guys the site. Um, I've got it on my Eve 9. Again, YouTube, this is an airsoft uh, gun. This is an airsoft gun. Uh, this is an airsoft gun. So um, this is not uh, real steel. This is not a, not a real firearm. But again, show you guys the red dot on the, uh, on the, uh, the unit. Looking good. Um, it's got uh, two different risers. It comes with a shorter riser, and I've got the longer riser on there. So if you can see that, um, this is the the tall, tall riser, um, and I think here I believe comes with the shorter um, riser so that it would be sitting um, basically. If you can see that. It would be sitting um, a little bit lower. Obviously, it's sitting on top of the Picatinny right now, but it would be sitting without the um, uh, about an inch off. You know, it just takes that whole um, riser out, so there's no riser. I guess would be for that shorter version, and it comes with a microfiber cloth for ch cleaning your lenses. Uh, main feature I want to talk about this on the bad boy. Uh, by the way, it does have all your regular features. Um, let me go let me, go, let me go and show you that real quick for you guys that want that are wondering. Um, you have your I guess this is a, this is just a battery compartment here. It's using uh, CR2032 batteries. So um, the battery is CR2032. You got your uh, your sight, your zeroing. It's just a knob. It's just a nice textured uh, textured knob. Let me see if I can get in there and show you. Yeah, you can kind of see uh, it's got a little bit of texturing. Um, main main features on this bad boy is you've got your up and down um, and uh, red dot intensity uh, buttons or rubber buttons on the top here for plus and minus. So you're just gonna tap one of those once to turn it on, or hold one of them maybe like three to five seconds to turn. The red dot back off. Um, it also comes with another one of the main features. It comes with is um, auto. It auto turns off. Um, it's what they call uh, it, if you're if you're not if, if it's not in motion, 
it will turn off automatically over time so if you happen to leave it on it's going to turn itself off um, to save battery so that's the, they call that the motion detected on feature um, but uh, it's, it's not motion detected on in my opinion really they that's kind of a uh, silly way of saying it because it doesn't turn on on its own guys don't get it mis mistaken it's not going to just turn on, on on its own like that that would be horrible right so no no you to turn it on you're just going to hit one of the the uh, sensitivity buttons so let's go ahead and do that and you can see hopefully I can maybe line that up to where you can see down it um, I'm not sure if you guys see that or not but the red dot is perfect 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 small dot okay it's actually really intense when you're inside when you're inside it's even more intense than it is outdoors but re again really tiny perfect dot it does follow all the way to the edge of the um, it does follow all the way to the edge so if you're um, looking at it from an angle um, it does um, have the full view no issues at all really and um, you can be far away from it really close and you're still gonna see the dot fine another one of the main features guys main features this these are lens protectors um, they're not just uh, they're not tinted at all but as you can see there is um, some plastic in there I think this front one has probably been hit I see a, a strike mark on it um, so, and it ha so it hasn't busted yet I don't know the strength on those um, so we're just kind of uh, still a pro um, time will tell whether those will break or not and I will update the video and let you guys know in the comment section if they do ever break but if you don't see a comment pinned at the top of the comment section then they're still working out for me and I've had this site for uh, like about four months five months and it's been fine for me so far I'm pretty sure it's been hit tw maybe twice guessing from the um, the marks on it so that's another main feature that I really like for airsoft especially um, a lot of people have to use those uh, lens um, protectors that go on your Picatinny rail that sit in front of your sight those are kind of annoying they get they get slapped down you have to put them the back the other way so that they lean against your sight and then they're like uh, leaning against your sight and they, 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 they just don't they're just finicky you know and um, but this is all in one package you're already ready to go you're, you feel like your sight is covered as long as you know this thing is going to break first and then you'll know okay well I need to come up with a new solution or maybe uh, put something in there uh, maybe you can even just take the back one off I mean this twists yeah actually you know what these are just ah okay it went flying on me but hey these do come off so hey if the front one breaks you just take the back one off and put it right on the front okay so there you go there you have it um, perfect lens protection and it's perfectly clear so that you can perfectly see through it no issues there it's not gonna be like a kill flash where you can't see through your dang sight because of the kill flash no it's perfect all in one package ready to go this site cost uh, on Amazon it's going for forty three ninety five it looks like there's only one left in stock but um, this is dagger defense it's a veteran owned company and I believe the guy that runs it uh, used, um, used to run uh, Tacticon which is another uh, company that makes really good sites that are affordable and um, kind of like uh, gyms in the in the in the rough um, where in on Amazon where you find a lot of um, really bad uh, sites that are cheap this 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 company happens to make um, this company dagger defense and tacticon which I think tacticon is kind of discontinued I don't even know think that they're making stuff anymore they're they're probably just selling the rest of the stuff they have but this company dagger defense here you probably be able to find one of their other models 
um, that is going to be s still in stock. If this one happens to go out of stock, or hopefully they will restock it. But again, Dagger Defense DD04N is what I'm rocking today on my KWA Eve 9. I will be hitting, coming back with you guys um, doing a video on this Eve 9, and I will release that as well. As, as along with a shooting test of the Eve 9 again YouTube this is an airsoft whip uh, airsoft gun not a real weapon just an airsoft gun I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, review and I hope you guys do get a chance to check this site out it's really sweet really tactical looking it sits high enough so that you can uh, see down it even with a face mask on and um, it's just perfect for me I haven't had any complaints at all if you guys uh, enjoyed the video, feel free to smash that like, smash that subscribe. We're going to be hitting you guys with some uh, great uh, reviews with uh, popular airsoft gear. And again, guys, thank you for reviewing. Thank you for coming here. And we're going to hit you guys up with a video on this Eve 9 very soon. And stay safe out there. Call your hit.